so we've got uh, three basic chord shapes here. We've got D. So we're going to hit the open D string. Second fret G. Third fret B. Um, second fret E. And I'm going to go to a, a D add two. Or, yeah, D, D sus two. And then to a sus four. So the uh, sus two. I'm just going to take, I'm just going to make the E string open there. And then you're going to hit the um, third fret for the sus four. So I'll show you what I'm doing with strumming hand there. So it's down, down. Slow it down. And then I'm going to hit the. So if, as if you're playing a G chord, but you're going to skip out the top E string, you're just going to go for this second fret on the A, a string there. So open D, open G, third fret. B, third fret E, and then an A chord, that's open A, and then fret right across the D, G and B string, second fret. Repeat that for the verses and then the chorus, uh, the chorus. So we've got a D again. You don't really have to play the, the um, top E, e string this time. I'm going to quickly go to the A and then make a B shape. You can just hit a power chord for this, you don't have to. You don't have to hit the full B chord. So I'm just going to hit the 2nd fret A, 4th fret D, 4th fret G. Then I'm going to hit the G chord. Because it's really quick, you know, you don't have, have really have time to make the full chord shapes. So... When I play a G chord, I don't really use the um, A string. I just really go for the um, third fret of E, and don't worry about the second fret of A. So I'm going to block the A string with this finger. So I'll slow it down. And then you go back to the verse, um, there's a little lead section. So I'm using a, um, a delay as well. I've got that set on 390 milliseconds. Um, but you, know, you don't have to worry about the effect. We'll just talk about the, the melody. So we're going to go for the 5th fret on D, hit that 3 times, go down to 4th fret, down to 2nd fret, and then open. And then you're going to hit the 2nd um, fret A, twice, and then you're going to hit open D again, back to 4th fret A, and 2nd fret D, open D. So when you hit that open D, 
that's the end of the um the solo. I'll do it with the effect. <laughs> And then later on in the song, you hear it higher up. So same notes, but on a different octave, the octave up. So I'll turn the effect off, and we're going to go for the A fret on B. And then 7th fret B. And then 5th. And I go for the 7th fret on G. Go down to 4th fret. G, up to 7, 6, 5 on B, and then 7 on G. So with the effect. Um, and that covers the whole song. Mm -hmm.